Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist Man the Foe. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinions. Man. It's time to watch another one of these Karen videos, man. Y'all know this is my guilty pleasure. Let's see what we got today. Karen's. Let's do this. Ready for some Karen's going full blast crazy? You've come to the right place, guys. Karen's use racial slurs, hate mm -hmm. kids, cut in line and chops, and trespass in your own backyard. Yeah, they do. Let's start with Karen in a courtroom. She's having a total meltdown. There's a reason you're in there in the first place, Karen. Troublemakers get sued. See what the judge has to say. I feel so attacked right now. I don't know what to do. Oh, no. Somebody oh. please send help. I'm just so attacked. Help. He's beating me with the gavel. Somebody get this ham sandwich out of my court. Here's a carrot in a the ham hospital, sandwich. but she only wants a white doctor to help her. This racist and her son deserve no doctor to help them. You see a white doctor. It's only available after four. Is it not? So you're saying in the whole entire building there isn't one white doctor? And your kid has to be seen by the pediatrician. Okay, so the, what you're telling me that my kid has chest pains, so he's going to have to sit here until four o'clock. Can I see a doctor please that's white? Why it doesn't have brown teeth. Yeah, or I don't know. English. Huh? Like the doctor is black. Okay, let's go. Being white in this country, I should just shoot myself. Being white makes him more. Go to the hospital. What? Speaking English is one thing. Being white is different. This one was How are you communicating to everyone? Everyone takes your kid and goes to English. Yeah. That's that breeding racism shit right there. Yeah, they got your kid up there. You telling these people that you don't only want to see a white doctor. Now you're going to go back home and make their kid feel like they couldn't be seen because they did something to you. Man, this shit, that's some dirty shit, man. And y'all breeding these people to be like that. A child clearly has more issues with you being his mother than him needing to see a doctor. You are extremely rude and racist. You want to talk about people being at a hospital maybe you should check yourself there was a daughter i don't care died over there i'm asking for my why, from, why are you yelling at me this is what happens when you are yelling at everyone you're, you're yelling at everyone uh, so what are you yelling at me no we are not fighting we're fighting you're because brown. you're brown you're all in time well there are i'm sure there are other people because who are reasonable no it's because i'm white no that's not okay step back this is my personal she is Switch to Chrome uh, to protect yourself from malware. Bro, so you can surf without damn getting shit. fished. This spoiled brat has been given a Tesla. Instead of being appreciative, she's moaning about not getting a pink Mercedes. You don't deserve anything for your sweet 16, Karen. You're my first car was. <laughs> I didn't want a Tesla. I don't, want, I don't like electric cars. Wait, I what? Like Mercedes Benz. I don't like Tesla. This, you like... Yeah. You said you like the electric cars. I said I like Tesla. I said a Mercedes Benz. I don't like Tesla. Well, you got to like, this is better than a Mercedes Benz. I ain't going to your mama. I don't want no car that, if I got to, I got to charge it for it to work. I didn't want that. Girl, you you charge your phone for it to work? Car. I could have, I could have just been walking it. I would rather walk it. Then we can get the car. Right. You, you should See, be happy. See, these are uppity black folks right here. Put, your, put the keys back in your purse. Oh, and I will. Look at the neighborhood. Nothing else. Oh, you would be happy sack. with that money. How much is it? Girl, open it up and stop being ungrateful because now you're starting to be ungrateful where well, you ain't got to worry about me I ever again. I never said I wanted a Tesla. You, I always told you I wanted a pink Mercedes Benz. Okay, well, Who I, I couldn't get the Mercedes Benz, so you and got then, that. this is all you gave me for my sweet 16 and my golden... Girl, do you know how much money that is? That's $1,600 for That's 16... That's it for my sweet oh my 16 God. and my golden birthday? Well, what is... I'm so appalled. My daughter's birthday next Friday, June 7th. She finna turn 16. She ain't getting a car or sixteen hundred dollars. She might get sixteen dollars. No. <laughs> oh man, I'm I'm oh my god, this little bitch, I'm mad as hell. You got a car for your birthday. You know I had to work for my first car, second, third, and everyone after that. I ain't never gave. I ain't never got given given a car. My mama did a couple times. You know, had access to her shit, but you know what I mean, man. 
I'm mad as hell. This little bitch getting a Tesla. This little bitch getting a Tesla, and she mad because it ain't a pink Mercedes. I'm going to be real with you. You don't look like a pink Mercedes type bitch. You don't look like a Tesla type bitch. You look like a, I don't know, man, a, a, a Winnebago. You ain't cute, bitch. You don't look like you got a damn a pink Mercedes. Pink Mercedes Benz. Bitch. Hell no. Whoa. And sixteen hundred dollars. One thousand six hundred dollars. You getting you guys, that? Look. You getting a bright? You getting a brand new car? Why would you do this? this is Nigga, if my mama would have gave me the keys to her car at sixteen thirty dollars, I'd have been straight. I'd have made a man. Just let me borrow your car for the day and then thirty dollars. Boy, look. I'd have had a time. That was back in the damn 90s, too. She crazy as hell. I think I turned 16 to 2000. Or was it 2001? I don't know, man. Or well, 99. I was born in 83. You know what I mean, though, man. This bitch is getting a, a brand new car and $1,600. Man. These kids, these days. Oh, oh, well, I don't even want to watch no more videos now. I think this got me mad, yo. My parents need to beat the damn dog shit out of her. My sweet 16 and my golden birthday, and you gave me a car I didn't even want, and then you gave me little money. You was being really, really little. Hard. You can take that shit back. Take that shit back. Take that shit back. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Take that shit. Yeah, so get back over here, and I'm not playing. Yes, I don't. Oh, here you go. Take that. So shit. you really don't want this Tesla? Yeah. Electric cars. I don't want to have to charge my car to get on it. You could have kept your gifts okay. and all that. I I'll take it back. I'll give to somebody that wanted it. Like, I did oh, not have to. Oh, fucking hell. What look? Is you serious? Worst birthday ever. Like, How well, is this your need... worst birthday? Because I didn't ask for. Did she just? You guys, I am so sorry. Don't be sorry. Be this. sorry for yourself, bitch. It's you. I actually thought she would be happy. You she should be ashamed of yourself as the parent, yo. First of all, you let her talk to you that way. Act up. Ungrateful. Like, God damn, boy. That shit hurt my soul right there, boy. Like, that's some... Man, I don't, it looks like she probably got two parents in the house. They like, they're like good people. She sound like... I don't know, man. You can tell the mama ain't ghetto and ratchet. Her mama's ghetto and ratchet. She would have damn did some damn dirt to her, boy. Boy. See, she she allowed to act like that. That's why she that's why she act like that. This ain't her first time acting like that. Yeah. I ain't raising nobody kids, man. He did you say know. she wanted a Mercedes Benz, but I couldn't get Bitch. her a pink one. So she always be like, oh, Teslas are nice. So I got her a Tesla. Kevin is hangry. His chicken's late. So in an act of revenge, he's threatening to get the employees fired. Don't be black. Or chicken. Don't or be employees. Don't Kevin, don't you don't belong on this planet. Maybe Musk can take you to Mars with him. Allowed to refuse service. So I'm going to tell the owner, you're losing money because we want to make a big order of food. Give me the fucking chicken. Give me the fucking chicken. Or I'm going to cause a scene. Get your owner here. Cause a scene. You record. You're going to lose money and get fired. We ordered food. And you want to refuse it? Look at you. You're telling me you're not being rude? <laughs> no, we weren't. Fuck you. Yeah. Give me my chicken. I came 30 miles to get a f***ing chicken. chicken. Give me my chicken. Give me my chicken. Give me my chicken. Miles. Chicken. <laughs> this woman is making sure everyone else on the plane is having the worst time imaginable. Life's not easy if your name's Karen. Give me my She's been freaking out for the last 20 minutes. She started off by telling everyone to pray for her mother who just passed away. Then she went up and down the aisles telling everyone to pray for her mother. And then she's been like this for the last yeah, 15, 20 minutes. I don't know if this guy next to her knows her or not. He's been trying to call her down the whole time. Oh, 
flight attendant asked me to make sure she doesn't like try to go to the back door and open it. If she tries to go back, I'm gonna, gonna block her. God, you're my saver. 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 Talk about the list. We don't let y'all got to be on the ground. This is an ordinary day at Dollar Tree. This employee has no patience with his customer. He's got some good lines too. Come on, all of us. This landlord demands the rent five days early. She'll even kick the door down if she has to. It doesn't matter if it's a two year old's birthday party. Karen wants her rent right now. Open up the door. I don't give a Oh, you're gonna tell them. So it's other people living in my house that's not paying rent. Yeah, you guys call the police and see what they say about that. Call the police and say what they say about that. This ain't legal, first of all. Don't try to call me. I don't even. I don't like your mom. This birthday, all of y'all, y'all motherfuckers in here staying without paying and paying no rent and none of that. That's a punch in your fucking face. Just I call the police. You want to break my foot, man? Call the police. You want to break my foot? You want to break my foot? You want to break my foot? The she's boss is there, but Kevin's looking for some human company. So he sits house, next to a woman, but she doesn't like him, nor the way he smells. Leave her alone. Why are you moving away? That's rude. Why are you coming with me? Because you stick. There's nothing wrong with me. You, no, What's wrong with me? No, just shut up, Nick. This is ridiculous. What I'm hearing from you is ridiculous. You stay. You literally chose to sit right next to me. What's wrong with that? On an empty bus. What's it's weird. What's wrong with that? It's weird. I don't know why you care so much. You don't even know me. Just shut up. What is it like if I know you? What is it now? Because it's a bit weird sitting next to someone that you don't know. Like, I don't, I'm not in the room, I don't really want to, I don't come on a bus to start dating someone. What's wrong with that? Well, I'll come over here to chat to you. I'm on the bus to get, to get to from me. I don't want to be on here to start with. talking to someone. Shut up, you're coming with some rudeness. Oh, you're really sullying yourself now? I think you're jumping on the empty bus and you're sitting right beside her. Yeah. Is that what this is? Really I think I've been in. Yeah, you're really sullying yourself now. It's like being in the bathroom with the urinal and somebody come right beside you like, what the hell? Shut up. Shut up. Exclusively on oh, ESPN Plus, UFC 302, Mahasha versus Poirier for the lightweight title. Karen shit. is messing with the wrong worker. Wait till the manager comes. Okay, let's get the paperwork done, and I need to get out of here. It doesn't work like that. It takes days. I want to talk to the manager. Okay, one second. Hi, how can I help you? What the <laughs> is real problem? Hell no. I just see my problem? problem? It's just you. You came in here acting like you own the place. I want to rent a yacht. Does it look like they have yachts? I see them all around there. We don't I have any yachts yesterday. to rent. I see them. Who's brought them? 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 Who
I already knew, I already knew what it was when I first got here though. He or she is one minute later trying to sound distressed so the police can come quicker. Yeah, it's that bullshit. Please, please. Oh, boy. Just like I hated with that, um, that woman did that shit at that park with that dog and that black dude, man. That's what first got me watching on Karen videos, man. I was so fucking disgusted about that. That woman choked that fucking dog up, man. About that shit, yeah. That's, um, damn, it was dirty, yeah. How she did that black dude. I'm calling bullshit. <laughs> what? That's how she screamed, she was trying to get that nigga shot, yeah. What? That's disgusting. What boy. in the world is this, boy? I ain't gonna lie. I've never in my life had to deal with no boy like this. That's never the, man, in my that's life. Dirty, man. <laughs> Karen's it's, proud of being unemployed. Her fucking um, her complexion for the connection, yo. That's dirty, man. That shit dangerous, yo. She gonna. Oh, this bitch gonna get on the phone. And, cry like that to the police because they that's all they hear they don't know what's going on so they thinking this white woman stressed in distress man they finna send fucking robocop nigga over there big ass white boy cop to subdue him and whatever without even knowing the situation man that's fucked up i'm glad he got the, that side of the camera though after they keep um you know do their research and shit but that's dirty let's see what this bitch did and living off the child support her ex is paying. But of course, nothing's good enough for our Karen. Karma awaits you in court, Karen. I can only go off of what he told me, and he said 90000 on the high end. I think you're in pretty good shape. What do you do for a living? I don't work. I take care of her kid. So you're a stay-at-home mom? Mm-hmm. And she's 11? He is. He is yeah. 11? Uh -huh. He goes to school? He does. So what do you do during the day? Nothing. Bitch. You don't want to work? No, no. So you're just living <laughs> off of his child support? I am. And we live with our mother. And you're proud of that? Well, well we were living with him, and I was a stay-at-home mom. He made the income. Okay. But, I mean... But you can work now, right? I can, but... So, it's no but, but you can go get a job, right? I could, but I'm not going to. My rent's free, my food is free. I mean, my mom's the homeowner. We don't have to pay nothing Okay, you know I'm not gonna go there with you today because you can. Obviously, you're able to work. I'm able, but and I don't you want should to. work. But again, that has nothing to do with me today. What we're going to do is talk about the modification of these numbers. All right. So your income has increased. Uh, it, it's it's increased about almost four hundred dollars. So based on you saying that you receive. About ninety thousand on the high end. It yes, brings man. your gross to about seventy five hundred dollars, which your net is five thousand four hundred and sixty five dollars and twenty two cents. That would bring well health insurance. Who covers health insurance? I do. And how much is that? It's one hundred and ten a month. Okay, one hundred and ten. So what I'm going to do is give you credit actually for the health insurance coverage for the child. So that would slightly bring your child support down. And Down. monthly, yes, <laughs> slightly. It, it's still expensive. Um, $1,093 a month is what he would pay in child support. That's it? That's it. That's it, bitch. You what would be more if you get a job? He would pay more if I got a job? No, it would be more for the child if you got a job. Bitch. Your Honor. Ma'am. No. You don't no, understand. No, you don't understand. I'm basing his child support increase off of what it is that he makes. Nothing he more. He makes more nothing than that. Until you bring me something in here to show me that, that's what I'm going to base it off of. You know, and again, you can work. Can so I, I, su can I, I suggest, say something? No, ma'am. Only thing I need you to say is, Miss Bunda B, I'm going to go find me a job. That's all I want to hear. If it's yeah. anything else other than that, I'm not entertaining it. Pertaining to what I just said, do you have any questions? I will go look for a job. But please, Great. Hear, please hear me out on one thing. What one is it? Thing. Make it quick. Uh, I promise you I'll make it quick. Let's say that you have a battery-operated vibrator. You know what? what? We're, we're <laughs> done right there. We're done. Is you're, there anything you're, you're about to, to climax. Oh, okay. Well, the batteries go out. Okay, thanks. 
That's him. Okay, great. Let me tell you what we're going to do. You all are done. And Hell if there's nah. nothing further, you all are dismissed. Thank you. Karen is parked in a disabled parking spot at her daughter's school. What the Poor fuck daughter. Are you to do, Maybe yo? she should just change school. You wanted me to move today? Yeah. Get the camera out of my face. She would have asked me to move. And all you had to do was say, hey, man, that's kind of rude. Why don't you move? Instead of coming up and taking pictures of it. Is that not rude? You're lucky my husband ain't here. You're lucky my oh, husband yeah. ain't here. If you had a child that needed that spot, it would be a different that's story. That's not handicapped, though, and that's why I moved way over so that the person oh, man, didn't know. It says keys. no parking, and it has lines because a person with uh, a disabled person needs that area in order to load and unload. I don't really care. Okay. You might want to watch yourself. Stop taking pictures of me. Look at him. I mean, is there a reason you have to take a picture because I was parked in a Ozzy spot? Ozzy oh, just ask me to no, move. yeah, the police will give you a ticket what if I take a picture. You, whatever. Been there, so. done that. Why didn't you just say, Been hey, can you move? Because I shouldn't have to. But you're rude, and I shouldn't have to deal with jerks like you. I know. I'm rude. She's like a retired rock star in the face. <laughs> yeah, we're at a we're at a children's He's school. Oh, well. Yes. No, you need to stop. You need to stop. I mean, seriously. <laughs> I want my kid out of this school. Right? Take him out, man. Okay. Karen's at Chick-fil-A drive-thru. Oops, she forgot the handbrake. Instant karma is served instead of fast food. Get your car. Get your car. You got this hand? This uh, is what we're concerned, ma'am. Wow. I think we need to call the police. Look at the dumb ass. Look at the dumb ass. Go, go get him. Go watch this shit, man. Good dumb ass. That shit, man. Look at you. That's what your ass get, bitch. Hey, y'all come back. She's called somebody. Influencer Damn, Karen skips the, the line at a concert that, because she's obnoxiously beautiful. Or so she says. Well, Karen, you might be beautiful on the outside, but you're definitely not beautiful on the inside. I just got a four thousand dollar loan sent straight to my bank account. I'm freaking out, dude, because now I can go on vacation. Video. You need to. So I'm sorry that um, that lady felt she had the right to physically assault me because. I Oh, shut up, bitch. Karen's picking on the poor delivery guy. How many times do you think she's using the word no? No, 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 no. no. You take to my apartment. You take to my apartment. No, you take to my apartment. No, no, no. no. You take to my apartment. They promised. They tell me, yes, you take it to my apartment. Okay, this is unbelievable, 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 unbelievable. You take to my apartment. I can't carry. I have a bad back. No way. No way, no way. God, God, no. God, no. God, no. God, no. God, no. I can't carry that. No, 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 no. You take it upstairs. Where's the other guy? No. The other guy? I'm single. I can't carry it. I'm old. I'm 60. 60 years old. No. FedEx has made the mistake of employing a racist Karen, but she won't have a job for much longer with an attitude like that. I don't care. I'll call yeah, my boss personally. Yeah, there you go. Get your boxes. Since all y'all want to stand there and look at me. Yeah. Help. How about that? Come help. Mira, la mis vanities. You can kiss my white ass. Blah, Just blah, leave. Blah. Girl, leave. sorry. Go back to your country. I can't understand what you're saying. This, this, is, America. America. this is America. No. This is America. I know. This, this is, is America. America. I don't know. Kevin's been disrespectful and homophobic to this waitress. Time to be put in your place. I honestly, nobody wants to wait on you. We're asking you nicely. We're being very nice. You please, please. That's it. You got a cup of coffee out of us. What more do you want? That's what do you it. want? I'm not, you're not going to call me a you're not gonna call people a lesbian. You sure as ain't gonna look at underage girl. I don't all look at underage yeah. girl. No. Let's go. Oh, that yeah. nasty motherfucker. You ain't looking at a little bitch. <laughs> you deserve to be locked up in Bellevue. And that's all I gotta say. And I'm asking you nicely. 
This Karen couple has missed their flight. They're given vouchers for a flight the next day. Boy, are they angry about that. That's the whole reason why we're standing here. Are you not understanding the fact that we have to return to Jackson Village? I can't get you a check. Okay, well, give me $600 voucher so I can find another flight so you can get us out of here. Here's the $200 voucher. $200. And 200 for the third person. Yeah. Let's get our voucher so I can get another plane. And they were more than $200 tickets, so I want my money back for what I paid for those tickets. Okay, when do you want to go out? And what is available that I have tomorrow? Because three of your clients. I'm not flying Southwest. I will go get on another plane, but I want money to go get on another plane. Okay, they will not accept our voucher just to let you know. So you're telling me that I'm screwed. So we're both going to lose our jobs because of what y'all did with it. I need a corporate number. I want, I want the general manager to right down here right now. Because I told them we were going to miss our flight. I told them we were going to miss our flight and wanted to do something about it then. And they told me to have a seat and we'll let you know when you're going to miss the flight. They so tell us after we, we missed, missed the, the flight. flight that we missed the flight. No sh we missed the flight. I could have told you that. Right. But the thing is, probably the sooner you could have got out would not have been within the 50 minutes. It would have been tomorrow still. We sat on that plane for an hour. What are you talking about? So you said 50 minutes prior. So you wouldn't have gotten anywhere 50 minutes sooner. Not to Jackson. Chris, Chris. Okay, so what do we do? Okay, the first available that I have okay, tomorrow. Okay, let's stop talking about tomorrow. There's three of us in an airport. Right. What do we do? You talk about tomorrow. And that's what I'm going to continue talking about. And the longer that we continue talking, the longer that the numbers keep going down. Okay, and so am I sleeping day. right here on this chair until tomorrow? That's nope. what I'm talking about. We're well, standing in an south. airport and you're talking about flights out tomorrow. Let them know. We are sleeping in Now, and now I'm going to I lost my job, so I don't know what I'm going to Oh, my God. Okay, just one way. I'll figure this out. We'll the first flight you can get. This is absolutely the first available for all three of you to travel together is at 1 o'clock tomorrow and at 5.15. 1 o'clock? No! That's the first available for three people to fly together. What's the first available for two? The first available really? for two. You two will have to go. Really? It would be at 10.30. Oh, how are you? 10.30 or 1 o'clock? We don't have a choice right now, and I don't know what to do. I don't, I don't want to know. Okay. Book the flight. Uh, Give me all your corporate numbers, too, because you're going to be hearing from a lawyer. You're going to be hearing from a lawyer. No, you're not. Good thing I got the corporate lawyer. No, so you don't. This all starts why, because the pilot has to steer. You got a corporate lawyer. You got a corporate lawyer. Yep. In jeopardy of losing your job from missing one day. You know what I mean? Like, if you don't. They can't understand what this situation is right here. And you get fired for I haven't lost my job, so I don't care. I'm just going to walk away. Shut up, punk ass. This pilot probably is drunk, wasn't paying attention. Oh, my God. Look. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm going to do. I have no idea what you're supposed to do. No one should get that excited about winning an argument. It's ridiculous, Karen. All of you, your father sat there for a whole week. I'm not going to move my truck. Guess what? He ended up moving it. Ooh, I won that one. Huh? Karen is harassing this employee over a $7 refund. This has pushed the employee to the limit. Are you happy now, Karen? Will she ever recover? Are you happy now? Are you happy? Yep. You see how upset I am? They're coming in here being nasty to me. Oh my god, here, take seven dollars. Here, you know what? I don't even care. Just take it all. Take it all. Here. Good language. Good I, language. I quit. I quit, lady. Good language. I quit. Somebody call Diane right now. I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> Here's a Karen who refuses to leave a store. Let's hear what the cops have got to say about that. Your hands off of me. 
You are kidnapping me. I want her. What is your name? I'll do your money. Let's, take, let's it, no. outside. take your hands off of me. You are. Ma'am. You don't have the right, sir. Ma'am. Get your Ma'am. hands Ma'am. off me. I've done nothing wrong. I am not a criminal. Get your Ma'am. hands off of me. Step Get your hands off of me. Ma'am. No. Sir, it's okay. Ma'am. 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 That's a violation. Ma'am. Take Ma'am. your hands off of Ma'am. me. Sir. Don't go behind me. You need to read the Constitution. Get your hands off of me. You don't have the right to do this. Take this is so illegal. Take your hands off of me, sir. I am not a criminal. I've done nothing wrong. I'm asking you to get your hand off of me. I'm asking you to take your hand off of me. Take your hand off of me. Take your hand off of me. I don't want your hand off of me. You're violating my personhood. I have a personhood. Look at this. You get this? You get this? I'm I'm asking him to take his hand off me. He has no right to kidnap me. This is kidnapping. You are. Let go of me. Let go of me. I'm happy to step out. This is is because the police department are ignorant of the constitutional rights. This is why this man has his hand on me. Uh And he's on my personhood. And I have the right to protect my personhood. No, sir. Take your hand off of me. Take your hand off. Don't steal my purse. That was ah, my purse. He's stealing my purse. I have done nothing wrong. Look, look. look at the white man. Take a picture of these guys. Get their names. Karen's trying to stop a fisherman from fishing. No, Karen, he isn't going to throw the fish back just because of you. In fact, nah. We say that for the next video. We're going to check this, this fishing video out next, man. But yo, that's what I'm doing over here now. Watching Karen videos. So. Check me out. I go live on the channel on Fridays. Holla at your boy. Heist me the folk. This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time. But I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.